hi everyone welcome back to my channel so today is going to be just a quick tutorial on the look that I did for Easter now I know Easter passed already and this is not the look I actually completely forgot to do an intro for my Easter look so I do apologize but I do have the final look in the video that you're going to be watching today and it is going to be just a color pop palette and um everything that is mentioned in the video will be in the description it is going to be a voiceover so thank you so much for coming by if you are new here welcome to my channel my name is veronica just a makeup enthusiast please hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it and we'll go ahead and get started Hey everyone, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know that I like to start my eyes by putting a primer or base, however you like to call it. Today I'm using the MAC Paint Pot in the color Painterly, so I'm just going to prep my eye here. If you are new here, I like to always use the primers or base to bring out the color to make it more vibrant and then also sometimes colors like the reds even like the purples and definitely like yellow sometimes they they um stain your skin so by placing this primer or base it kind of puts that barrier to keep that from happening and then also it adds the barrier if you have watery eyes due to the season or some type of um you know allergy towards your shadows this helps keep your eye from watering okay so we're gonna go ahead and get started on the eye look and i'm choosing the color pop making mauves palette i'm gonna go ahead and start with the transition color and on a fluffy brush i'm going to use the color big fig and just gonna place that right above the crease line so right below the brow bone and just blend that inward and kind of get it all nice and blended into the skin now that we got the transition color taken care of i'm going on with the next one in the color marque on a more dense fluffy brush and i'm just going to blend that from the outside in just like you see there the old school term would be the outer V now um, I hear a lot more people just saying that they're going to be putting it on their on the outside corner of their eye I didn't really like the depth or I wanted more depth not that I didn't like the depth I wanted more depth so I went ahead and I picked up a MAC dark purple and it's the color sketch so with the with a dense brush I'm gonna go ahead and pick that up to do the outer corner of my eye and um, blend that into the rest of the look On this next part, I'm going to pick up my NYX Glitter Primer. Some people call it glitter glue, but I am going to just put a generous amount on the inner corner of my eye, kind of like where you put your, you know, some people like to put a little dot or a little piece of glitter or shimmer in the inner part of their eye. So I'm going to put that on both sides now that the glitter primer is down I'm gonna pick up the shimmer a la mode on a flat brush and I'm just gonna generously place that on there with the brush and I'm tapping it instead of you know um, rubbing it from one side to the other and then um, 
I will uh, pick up a little bit more to, and then just continue to pat that down. Now that we have both the eyes nice and shimmered, I went ahead and picked up my paint pot again in Painterly, and I'm going to put it at on the bottom lash line. <coughs> I typically always do the bottom lash line. Um, I Typically, I'll, when I'm putting on my Painterly, I'll put on both the top and the bottom at the same time, but for some reason, I forgot this time. Now, I'm going to go in with the color Marque and I'm going to use this like a little smudge smudge brush and I'm going to do that from the outside in but I'm not going all the way to the front of my lower lash line I'm gonna stop about halfway maybe a little more than halfway and I do that same exact same um the same exact thing on the other eye as well now I'm going to go in with a shimmer and the color is mauve on top and I'm going to put that on my lower lash line from the inner corner and then I'm going to kind of work it into the first color which was Marque that I put down there. This is the final look. I just put together a few of the pictures. Thank you all so much. Please hit that like button and let me know if this is something that you prefer. New people, subscribe, hit that bell. Talk to you all soon.